The Neurobiology of Learning and Memory, is a comprehensive textbook written by Jerry W. Rudy. Published in 2008, the book provides an in-depth exploration of the biological mechanisms underlying the processes of learning and memory in the brain. It combines insights from neuroscience, psychology, and biology to offer a detailed understanding of how these cognitive functions are orchestrated at the neural level. Key points covered in The Neurobiology of Learning and Memory include 1. Neural Substrates of Learning and Memory The book examines the brain structures and neural pathways involved in learning and memory. It discusses how information is processed and stored, encompassing regions such as the hippocampus, amygdala, and neocortex. 2. Long-Term Potentiation, LTP Rudy delves into the concept of long-term potentiation, a mechanism through which synaptic connections between neurons strengthen in response to repeated stimulation. LTP is considered a fundamental process underlying learning and memory. 3. Synaptic Plasticity The book explores the concept of synaptic plasticity, which refers to the adaptability of synapses in response to experience. It covers both long-term potentiation, LTP, and long-term depression, limited, as mechanisms for strengthening and weakening synaptic connections. 4. Consolidation. Rudy discusses the process of memory consolidation, which involves stabilizing and storing newly acquired information over time. He examines how memories transition from short-term to long-term storage through the involvement of various brain regions and molecular processes. 5. Types of memory. The book differentiates between various types of memory, such as declarative memory, explicit memory, and procedural memory, implicit memory. It explores the neural circuits and brain areas responsible for these distinct memory systems. 6. Neurotransmitters and Neuromodulators The author delves into the roles of neurotransmitters and neuromodulators in learning and memory. He discusses how molecules like glutamate, acetylcholine, and dopamine influence synaptic plasticity and cognitive processes. 7. Learning and Memory Disorders The book touches on disorders related to learning and memory, including amnesia, Alzheimer's disease, and other neurodegenerative conditions. It explores the neural basis of these disorders and their impact on cognitive function. Eight. Learning and memory across species. Rudy examines how principles of learning and memory extend across different species, from simple organisms to complex mammals. He provides insights into the evolutionary aspects of memory systems. 9. Emerging research. Throughout the book, Rudy integrates findings from contemporary research and emerging technologies that shed light on the intricacies of neural processes underlying learning and memory. The neurobiology of learning and memory offers a comprehensive exploration of the intricate connections between brain function and cognitive processes. By delving into the neurobiological foundations of learning and memory, Rudy provides readers with a deeper understanding of how information is acquired, stored, and retrieved within the brain. The book serves as a valuable resource for students, researchers, and professionals in the fields of neuroscience, psychology, and cognitive science, as it bridges the gap between theoretical concepts and empirical research in the domain of memory and learning.